The New Jersey Devils hosting the Carolina Hurricanes, and the Hurricanes are minus 240 on the money line. The Devils are plus 200. The over-under is 6.5 goals. Carolina laying a goal and a half are plus 110, meaning they'd have to win the game by two. The Devils getting a goal and a half are minus 130, meaning they could not lose the game by two. Carolina is on a two-game winning streak. They are 5-5 five and five in their past 10 games, and in those games where they are a favorite and had to win the game by two, minus a goal and a half, they are 5-4. and four. Now, the Devils are on a one-game losing streak. They are 2-8 and eight in their past 10 games, and in those games where they were an underdog and could not lose the game by two, getting a goal and a half, they are 4-2. and two. Head-to-head, -head, the home team's on a three-game winning streak. These teams are 5-5 five and five in their past 10 meetings. The over is 2-1. and one. These teams have played three times this year. Carolina won 2-1. The Devils won 7-4. Carolina won 5-2. So, like I said, the home team's on a three-game winning streak. The home team has won every game they've played this year. I'm going to take the Devils with the money line. The Devils getting the goals. I'm going to go over the 6.5. Two out of those three games went over. So, let's see if that trend continues. And the Devils tend to play up to their opponent even though they're very bad. Let's see if I'm right. Let's see if I'm wrong.